Hey YouTube, Shuku and Shui here, and there's my cat. But I am spending my Memorial Day sitting on the ground like an idiot with this RC Michelangelo from Jack Specific. And now this is part of the XPV series. Uh, we took a look at the Captain America Iron Man Avengers Rumble Rollover, whatever it was called. There's Bella wanting to know what the heck is going on because I'm not usually recording videos sitting on the floor. But, <laughs> that's where we're at, because this guy's actually uh, pretty big, as you can see just by Bella standing next to it. Uh, it is pretty tall. Now, you do get the Michelangelo figure, pardon her, uh, the Michelangelo figure that sits on top of the remote control skateboard. And it can come off, I think, I don't know. It comes separated in the box. I don't think it can come off, though, I don't know. But the uh, figure itself is actually pretty cool. Uh, here is a quick shot of the figure. So like I said, pretty cool. It's not posable or anything of the like. Uh, it's pretty much just a big old hollow piece. But it is still uh, pretty neat nonetheless. Skateboard is as you would expect. It actually does even have rubber grips. Uh, even though they serve absolutely no purpose whatsoever and could just be plastic, it's cool. That's a little bit of a realistic uh, touch onto this thing. So, yeah, I received this in the mail randomly, and it was fantastic. It, it, I honestly brightened up my day because I wasn't having too good of a day that day. Uh, but I opened up this thing, and it, it, it's fun. It has the same problem, I think, with the Avengers uh, RC car did in that the controlling is a little bit wacky. Uh, it's not easy, but given these like simplified RC cars that are on the market, it's kind of a gimme uh, at this point. Here is a look at the controller for it, which is actually really cool. Uh, it's got the nunchucks or nunchaku that uh, Michelangelo is known for. This button lets him spin around like an idiot. And this button makes him go forward. So as you can see, there's no way to actually turn it and control it. It's all kind of on a whim. And that makes it both exciting and frustrating <laughs> at the same time. But I do really like this guy. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate it right now in the middle of my house because it's rainy outside. So I'm stuck here doing this indoors on the floor. But <laughs> at the very least... Uh, this is available for, I think, $69.99, and it is exclusive to Walmart stores. So if you want to pick this up for yourself or for your kids, uh, you're going to have to check out your local Walmart. Uh, their price may vary depending on sales and stuff, but the list price is $69.99. So if we go ahead and flip this down here, there's a battery compartment right here. Now, this battery compartment takes five C batteries. Five C batteries batteries. Yep, that's absurd, Bella. You know it. <laughs> so I had to go to the dollar store to get C batteries because who actually has C batteries in their house anymore? But once you get that going, there is the switch right there that will turn this on. Then you can plop it down. Bella will freak out. I promise you that. This takes, I think, it, <laughs> yeah, you're interested in that? Yeah. Uh, this does take, I think, two uh, double A's. I believe they come included. Uh, however with that so there you go you just go ahead and snap that on and the it's fun so begins epic. I forgot he talks to you this is gonna be epic it is gonna be epic Mikey I promise you that so there is clips from the Michelangelo character from the new show well it's not really new anymore it's, it's like fourth season starting up soon but uh, it does, there's voice clips from that and every time you press the button a new voice clip plays there's no way to turn it off. So if you're going like this, back and forth, you're gonna get a lot of voice clips that don't stop. That's my only really major complaint with the voice gimmick. I wish it was just a separate button that you can use, but like I said, if you go ahead and press this button right here, it will cause him to spin. <laughs> So he's quite talented at the skateboarding. Mode. And unfortunately, you can't really hear it. The voice clips, rather, over the sound of the of the motors. But hey. So 
<laughs> you can do that. Face the camera. Don't be shy, Michelangelo. And uh, so you, the way that this is designed, as you can see, you you are everywhere. Uh, there's no way to press both at the same time. That's just how it's designed. Watch this. <laughs> oh, lovely. I'm waiting for this to just smack right into the camera. But as you can see, controlling this thing is very haphazard. Um, if you were to try to get this through an obstacle course, you would probably fail. But that's fine because it's Michelangelo, you're bound to fail anyway. But we love him dearly, no matter what. So like I said, yeah, it's, uh, it's very much random. So I'm gonna just kind of end it here. <laughs> um, this is a lot of fun. I don't know if it's $69.99 fun, but as a Turtles fan, especially of the new series, that they're doing a phenomenal job on that series. Um, I really do like this, and fans of the series and um, kids that enjoy the series, which are also fans of the series, will probably really get a kick out of this as well, especially if you're a fan of Michelangelo. Um, let me see if I can snap this off real quick. I'm just a party dude. Take the time. I'm thinking sausage and jelly beans. So long, sucker. <laughs> you know what to do. I'm here. I'm there. I can be anywhere. Oh, snap! I three. How do you stop what you can't even see? I got you, dude. This is gonna be epic. Oh yeah, Michelangelo is on the move. Booyakasha! I think that might be all the phrases. There's a lot of them packed in here. But like I said, I kind of wish it was a separate button because every time you go to control him in some fashion, be it I'm forward party, or spinning, you end up getting a clip. And if you're kind of going back and forth to try to control this thing, <laughs> Anna is really intent on finding out what this thing is. I kind of wish it was still on. But <laughs> at the very least, uh, that is a little bit obnoxious, but the phrases are kind of cool in their own special way. So like I said, $69.99 at your local Walmarts um, if you want to go ahead and pick this up for themselves. Huge thanks to Jack Specific for uh, sending me this. It will gladly sit on my Turtles shelf uh, looking all cool. At the very least, if you're not a huge fan of the RC aspect, it does make a pretty cool display piece. Like I said, the Michelangelo figure is actually pretty nice. It doesn't really have too much in the way of posability. Um, you might be able to move his arms a smidge, but it does look really cool. And uh, I like the kind of wheelies that it can do and stuff. It's a neat little toy, uh, for sure. Like I said, I don't know if I would necessarily pay $69.99 for it. But it is definitely pretty cool. So again, huge thanks to Jack Specific for sending this my way. And uh, enjoying the Memorial Day with my favorite turtles. So, that about does it for the show. If you like it, go ahead and blast that like button. Comment below and subscribe for more. So as always, thanks for watching. Take care and have a great one. Bye.